A street enforcement team is coming to Medway next year and they're here to issue fines if you don't pick up your litter. It looks like the litter enforcement officers are definitely needed, not just on land, but in water as well. And for this bottle of juice that will cost you no more than a couple of pounds, you could face a fine of £150. But is this piece of litter really worth the worry of violence? If you pay in time, the fine could be reduced to £90, but councillor Alex Patterson said that they might have to take a punch from angered members of the public and is concerned about the safety risk the job has. The fact that they, they might be in danger, um, which I think you know was borne out by a, a court case in Margate just last month where there was an enforcement officer who was assaulted by a member of the public, that may create a situation where we find that they uh, only enforce uh, the, the litter rules in well-lit public areas when in fact the experience in my ward in Rochester West and across Medway is that these problems tend to exist in the dark corners. Officers will be equipped with body cameras and will receive full training to help deal with confrontation but the rest is up to the private company who's in charge. But is it crazy to think that someone who issues fines could expect to wear stab vests? But I, hopefully that you know it, it should never happen that people have got to wear stab vests to pick up litter. Intimidation and threats I get from the householders and the general public. I've heard it for years now and it's really getting stupid and out of hand now to be truthful. Medway council officers insist that they wouldn't need to wear stab vests when they begin patrolling as early as June 2019, but knows that litter is still definitely a problem. Well, traffic wardens, uh, often that leads to people getting upset when they get a traffic ticket and that uh, can uh, lead to anger but that doesn't very often lead to violence at all and it's extremely rare that there would be a violent confrontation and we don't issue our traffic wardens with stab vests and if you go around with your camera you would be impossible not to find any town in England without any litter on the streets. Litter doesn't seem like something worth fighting about but in this case you can never be too safe. Isabel Miller for KMTV.